The Dallas City Council took a significant step that could change the landscape of where short term rentals are allowed to be in the city. The City Council recommended that it is zoning to draft, or excuse me, it's zoning staff to draft an ordinance that would redefine short term rentals as hotels. Fox 4's Lori Brown joining us with the story. Lori. Steve, if the city of Dallas does in fact end up zoning short term rentals as lodging, it would mean that they would be allowed in areas zoned for hotels and illegal in areas zoned residential. This is the butterfly bush. This will this will start blooming. Olive Talley loves her Dallas neighborhood in the Edgemont Park Conservation District. <laughs> if everything gets watered, it comes back. She is one of many homeowners who started asking Dallas to protect neighborhoods about two and a half years ago against short term rentals. We've had parties, we've had drugs, we've had parking, you name it. The Dallas Neighborhood Coalition soon formed. What's really happened with our Dallas Neighborhood Coalition is a coming together of of residents all over the city. For months now, Dallas residents have been voicing their concerns at city council meetings. These Airbnbs are truly eroding that sense of community. I know of people who have moved out of Dallas because of STRs. The coalition says its solution is proper zoning. We want to be living next door to a home, not a hotel. Councilwoman Carolyn King Arnold has dubbed it the keep it simple solution. And hopefully we will get to the point where we can get the citizens what they want, which is peace and quiet and be able to live in a neighborhood. Late Wednesday, Councilman Paul Ridley recommended this to find short term rentals as lodging use. So they are zoned the same as hotels, preventing them from operating in neighborhoods. I think it would uh, expedite the process at CPC and ZOAC if we identified um, what was the consensus choice. There was no official vote since it was a briefing agenda, but there was this. Silence will be unanimous consent that that is the consensus. We are really grateful for the city council and the city staff because they've been listening to us and they've also been listening to the voice of their legal counsel who has said the best way, the most legally sound way to regulate STRs is through clear zoning and strong regulations. A proposed ordinance from the City Plan Commission could be ready for a vote by the Dallas City Council as early as September.